Hey guys, we're all the way here and today I'm back in today's video I'm gonna be playing Minecraft. Just just Minecraft Java Edition, not Minecraft Dungeons today. But we will uh I'm not done with that series, don't worry. Um basically what we are going to be doing today is um would you shut here, hold on, I gotta turn this down. I just remembered that that is way too loud for video making. Okay. So what we will be doing is uh I will be doing a review for the twenty W twenty two A snapshot. It, uh, I've never done a snapshot review before, so don't judge me. I haven't set anything up. I just hopped in here, started recording, and you guys are gonna go with me throughout the journey. Don't don't judge me. Okay. Anyway, here we go. So basically, the first change is uh, well, piglins will now dance in a sometimes in a com in in celebration of a completed hunt. So basically, when they hunt one of those big boys over there, and they basically complete that hunt and they do good on the hunt then they will uh dance and i was honestly hoping that this would be if you played their music disc but nope it is because they are celebrating a hunt we will summon in loads of them i hope it is not too loud you know what we will turn it down even farther just because i feel like that might be too loud okay now let's spawn those in spawn in some hoglins and crap let let everything go And, uh, yeah, so now that we got that, let's just watch until the hunt starts. <gasps> oh, that's really cute, though. Oh, that's so cute, dude. Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Whose kids are the. Frick. Dude. Dance. Yes, they're dancing! Wait, no, one of the, the dead one was dancing. <gasps> Dude, look at this! They're dead! Oh, look at that! <laughs> this is the best feature in the game. Did I have to wait about like 15 minutes for that? Yeah, was it worth it? Heck yes, that was awesome. That was pretty dang cool, honestly. <gasps> Ooh, let's see if we can see it again. Probably not, but we can try. They killed it. And now they're not dancing. Oh crap, here comes another one. Come on, my guys, dance. Make him dance. Come on, kill them. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Oh, they're not dancing. <gasps> oh, he killed it, but he's not dancing. Ah, uh, sad. Oh. Well, anyway, we saw it dance. Um, let's go on to the next change. Okay, guys, so the next change is uh, players and entity uh, can no longer uh, ride on entities when they are crouching. So when I crouch, let me listen, let you listen to my clicking. I can no longer ride the thing. But if I just get off and I click, I can now ride it. I cannot ride it. Trust me, I'm trying extremely hard. It's not working. Another good example of this is is a strider. So. There we go. See, I can get on it. Get off. Hold crouch. I can no longer get on the strider. This one's an even better example because my hand still moves. Cool. So, yeah, we can no longer get on top of things while we are crouching. On to the next change. Okay, guys. So, the next change is a bit of villager changing. So, basically, uh, in the new snapshot, if a uh, there's some villager workstation logic. So, uh, the best way to explain this is with an example. So, I will go ahead and say, uh, let's say there was a librarian you traded with, like, loads. And if you didn't know when you trade with a villager type, that villager type will no longer, uh... Well, okay, here. Let me re-elaborate. I, I get confused easily. I'm not good at explaining things. But when you trade with a villager type, it will stay that villager type forever. Before... Even if it was stuck on that villager type, if it lost its workstation, it would go and try and find a new job. Basically, if it was a librarian and it lost its workstation, it would keep the same skin on, but it would go and change over to a, let's say, a, a, a butcher. Okay? But now it won't do that anymore. It will just be jobless or workstationless until you... Uh, until it finds another of the same type of workstation sta it was on. 
So basically this farmer, I haven't traded with him. If he lost his workstation, he could convert over to a different type of villager. But if I traded with him, he could not. So, uh, yeah, hopefully that makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense. I know it. Okay. Uh, so now the bells can also be hung on different, uh, di uh more blocks. One that I know is for sure is uh, the chain. I don't believe you could hang them on those previously. They can now be hung on multiple different blocks. I don't have a list right now, so don't exactly know. But I do know that is one of them. And, uh, yeah, no judge. So, um, I believe the uh, there was, like, loads of other village changes. Oh, yeah. When a villager that was traded with was struck by lightning it will and turns into a witch, it will no longer despawn. So if you trade it with a villager and it gets struck by lightning and it turns into a witch, it will not despawn anymore. Pretty simple, pretty easy, and it just makes a lot more sense. But uh, everything else is just technical changes, a few different things like shader support and stuff. But other than that, if you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye!